Hello, this is my first ever review on YouTube and this review I'm going to review of the Black Diamond Axis 24 backpack. It's a, re a relatively small backpack but you can stuff tons of things in it if you pack the right things. It's a climbing backpack, specific, but I use it for commuting to work and uh, day hikes. So, and I just had it for like one week, but I like it already. It's sturdy, it has uh, good fabric, sturdy fabric. It's 420D nylon and welded nylon, nylon at the bottom or places where you need it to be. This fiddly things is for your your hiking poles or uh, for this pack it's for the ice axis and this pack and this sleeve is for the points for the axe to go in and here's uh, I'm holding just with one hand so it's uh, there you have your for, uh, I don't know, maybe skis or, or, or for, I think it's for the, the ice axis. It's a big sturdy buck buckle and this is, a, uh, I like this pack. These things, you have a, a, um, a strap. You strap around your or crampons or sharp stuff and it has compression straps too you can adjust them here and one on top and you have a top lid a small one for like your phone key phone wallet or whatever and on the back side you have a sturdy sturdy foam back. I don't know how thick it is, maybe a half millimeter or so, five millimeters thick. And non-adjustable up here straps. And here's for the the hose for the bladder goes inside and I'll show you in a minute or two. So it's two on each side and the straps, shoulder straps and this is swing arm or reactive as a diamond, black diamond call it and it's a wire connected here and goes through and under the backpack inside and up in the other so if you pull it here it's smaller there and you also have a waist belt a small one but a waist belt if you have something big it's it's a good one too so I'm gonna focus yeah whatever that's uh, on the back side and you have a stern stern strap as well that goes like this and you can adjust it pretty easy just up and pull it up and down and here you have a the big opening to the big compartment and it's and you open it pretty and it's pretty big opening and here you have a another pocket for your beloved things like your keys or whatever and you have a key key clip here as well that's good I like it and uh, this strap here the blue one is for whatever you want to cinch down on inside or on the pack like a climbing rope or 
I'd use my I use it right now to clamp down my since down my thermo wrist sleeping pad on top and you just take it out the H2O hole the backpack and the backpack as I said it's it's roomy for this small pack this is my my father's old caravan sleeping bag bag down it's not so much warm anymore I have two of these so they connect together that's, that's another review and here's the empty one empty bag it's uh, if you pack it right you can have a ton of tons of things and here's this one is for the bladder to hang your bladder in and here's the, the pack for the bladder and it has a, a broad bungee cord or whatever you can call it it's fold, folded so you can have a pretty, pretty big bladder I think it's 2 to 3 liter if you want to so I like this pack I love this pack it's it's sturdy and it fits me I'm 184 centimeters tall and broad sh shouldered if you know what I mean so it's it's good I like it so I hope you enjoy the review of this pack if you have any any more questions just comment below and by the way I think I'm the few ones that have has this pack axis 24 in Sweden and I think I'm having the first review on YouTube anyway uh, there's a one of the axis 33 just one so I thought I would do a, new, a re review of the 24 like I said it's it's a good pack sturdy and it's and it's, and it's gonna last for years bye for now